Once upon a time there lived a man named Subramanium who was a wise man who thought kings and trained their future. Higher as he was a master of everything and he trained each and every king that had been in the throne. He also had a son named Prasanna who was a very good looking boy one day the king's son Indrajit and his sister visited Subramaniam to learn and gain knowledge from his expertise good morning sir by the comment of my king I am here to learn and understand the true ways of a prince you are welcome to be her prince the king has already informed me about this before from tomorrow onwards your training session will begin thank you so much sir i shall see you tomorrow morning to train with you indrajit and his sister leaves the place to go back to their kingdom but as they were going back in dravati the sister of indrajit sees prasanna and she immediately is Attracted to him Indrajit looks at his sister and says this. Shall we live? Indravati kept looking at Prasanna no matter how many times her brother called. Her Prasanna also looked back at Indravati and was smitten by how beautiful she was the next day morning. Indravati Indrajit Indravati's friend. Pramila visits the Guru at that time. Indravati's friend Pramila goes to Prasanna with a bouquet of flowers and she says this to him. This bouquet of flaws was handcrafted by a princess Indravati she told me to give this to you and not tell this to anybody. Pramila gives the bouquet of flowers to Prasanna after receiving the flowers. Prasanna immediately falls in love with Indravati's affection and gift smitten. By Indravati Prasanna says this to Pramila tell the princess that I love and admire what she has done for me and in return I will be more than willing to even give my life after that incident. Both Prasanna and Indravati fell in love. Every time Indravati would enter the Guru's place to train she would always speak to Prasanna for hours after a while the training session had finally gotten over on the last day of the training Indravati and President. Indravati looks at Prasanna and says this from today onwards the training has finished i don't think we would be able to meet each other regularly again i shall go to my father and tell this to him immediately and we shall get married you're right princess the minute i saw you i immediately fell in love with you but now since you're talking about Marriage I'm quite afraid you don't worry I will talk to my father and will make him accept that is not the reason why I am afraid I am afraid because I'm just a normal person whereas you are the princess of the nation will the eldest accept our marriage you do not have to worry about anything I shall go to my father and make him accept this marriage and we shall live happily okay find the princess immediately leaves back to her kingdom to give the information regarding her newfound lover and to fix up her marriage as soon as she enters the palace she sees the king the king looks at her and says this welcome princess i have been waiting for this to tell you a very special surprise that has occurred. 
in our kingdom I am also here to tell. You have very good news my father first you. Can tell me your good news and after. That I shall tell you my good news I. Have such a great news the prince of our. Neighboring nation named Vikraman has. Sent a request to our kingdom to marry. You knowing that you would never disobey. My wishes I have given them my promise. That I would fix up a marriage between. You and Vikraman after hearing what the. King said his daughter was appalled and. Shocked she was unable to make a choice. Between her newfound love and the. Respect she has for her father she could. Not tell him about Prasanna and she. Could not refuse his request not knowing. That her daughter is in love the king. Starts to make arrangements for the. Marriage to take place meanwhile even. Prasanna got to know about the. Information at that time he says this to. Himself. Oh my God what has happened she told me. That she would leave to her kingdom and. Get her father's permission for marriage. But now she is willing to marry another. Man that means she has rejected me do. To this situation prisoner gets into a. Depressed state of mind he does his best. To clear his mind but he is unable to. Prasanna then decides to see Indravati. For one last time but he was unable to. Enter the palace to talk to her after a. While the marriage was just about to. Happen and the whole nation was calling. The princess as the new bride I was. Waiting all this while for Indra with. His marriage to be stopped but it looks. Like she is about to get married anyway. I don't think I want to live anymore I. Think committing suicide is the best. Thing that I should do before Indravati. Gets married it is a tradition in the. Nation that Indravati and the brides made. Go to a nearby temple get blessings from. Goddess Durga the temple that they enter. Intended to go to was nearby the. Outskirts of the city Prasanna came. Across a tree he looked at it and said. This to himself if I sit here and wait. For Indravati maybe I could get a. Glimpse of her and finally find peace in. My soul I also want to make sure that I. Commit suicide under this tree so that. At least she could get a glimpse of me. Meanwhile one of Indravati's bridesmaids. Pramila was in the forest collecting. Some flowers behind her there was a man. Named Nandan who was a very good. Looking individual Pramila looks at him. And becomes very shy and nervous as he. Is a very handsome man. All of a sudden a huge elephant runs. Through the forest it runs towards the path of Promila and she does not know what to do. Run away. At that tank every single person in that forest area starts running away as they are absolutely afraid of that elephant. This elephant runs towards the path of Promila and she does not know what to do. She just stares at the running elephant. Blankly but on and then luckily grabs. Her and saves her from the running. Elephant after saving her he then takes. Her to a safe place and then places her. Down and then says this to her hey lady. Do not be afraid you are now in a safe. Place the elephant will not harm you. Anymore. Pramila could not hear a single word. 
Anandan was saying to her as she was absolutely smitten by his beauty and his look the elephant runs away to another region where there are a lot of people and then goes to that area to save them again looking at an and then leaving Pramila says this I don't know who that man is in this elephant has taken him away from me I don't know if I can never see him again or know what his name is nevertheless now I should focus on what I came here for I have to go and meet Princess Intravati as soon as possible. As Pramila went to meet her bridesmaid, and Indravati Anandan comes back to the place and he sees that Pramila is not there, he feels bad that he had missed her and says this to himself Where is that sweet girl that I just saved from an elephant? She looked very Beautiful and the last time I saw her She was picking flowers if she was Picking flowers that means that she is Heading towards the temple I shall go to The temple to see if she is there As Anandan kept Towards the temple he Is At Prasanna sitting under a tree his Face was very sad and and then looked at Prasanna and asked this hey man did you See a girl that was picking flowers come Across this way Prasanna was already sad about his life And he did not care what Anandan had to Say he did not respond and he kept quiet With the sad face and and then looked at him and said this what happened in your life that you were so upset and sad if you can tell me exactly what you have gone through maybe I can help you come on tell me my friend please don't mind me I am an unfortunate and unlucky soul my life is a mess please tell me what happened I really want to help you Prasanna proceeded to tell everything that had occurred until then he told him about the time he spent within Dravati and the fact that she is getting married to another man named Vikraman and also told him that he is going to kill himself at any time soon are you serious do you really want to kill yourself over Something simple like this every problem Has a solution my friend just a while Ago I met a girl and I am immediately Fell in love with her but now I am Unable to Committing suicide By talking heard some sound See what is happening under bridesmaids Are coming here to do puja in the temple you can live here my friend I am going to kill myself you called me a friend and I will not leave you until I find a solution for you just listen to me and do as I say if I can get my Indravati I will do anything that you tell me fine come with me we both should be in the temple before they arrive here went inside the temple and hid behind Draga statue inside the temple after a while Indravati and her bridesmaids enter the temple Indravati goes into Draga Devi statue room and locks the door from inside once she sees Draga Devi statue she says this why have you ruined my life I fell in love with one Man and now you're making me marry Another man at least in my next life Please give me the privilege of marrying My love Prasanna I cannot live here After after Indravati said that she Takes a knife and she tries to slit her 
own throat standing behind Jurgadevi. Statue Prasanna watches all of this. Immediately Prasanna runs towards her to prevent her from killing herself. Indravati looks at Prasanna and is shocked to see him she says this to him. He were finally here I am so glad to see you I am so sorry that I did not give you any information about what I'm going through I did not want to marry Vikraman. But at the same time I cannot disobey my father that is why I am trying to kill myself please forgive me no you must forgive me it is my fault when we both fell in love I should have been the one to go to your father and tell him what we were planning to do but instead I was a covert and backed away and when I was thinking about killing myself this honor then saved my life after both Prasanna and Indravati kept talking to each other on and then listens to both of them and says this have you both gone crazy come on you both are deeply in love with each other instead of going to the elders and letting them know what you guys want to do you both are trying to kill yourself and break the hearts of your parents please do the right thing instead of wasting your time the reason why I wanted to kill myself is not because I couldn't marry the man that I fell in love love it it is because I couldn't disobey my father because he had promised Vikraman that he would let him marry me since my father is a man who never takes away from his promise I decided to kill myself the man that is a hindrance to your wedding is not your father but Vikraman himself if you can convince Vikraman to back away from the marriage and refuse to marry you you can marry Prasanna and live happily ever after but how is that possible how can I do such a thing I have never seen Vikram before when I don't know him how can I make him change his decision that means you both do not know what is happening right now I am the man who your father gave a promise to and I am the man who saved your true love Prasanna and I have bought him to you they both realize that Anna then is Vikramand and he is putting an act and was in disguise they both were shocked by this revelation what are you talking about my friend if you are the prince Vikramand who are you here in disguise I heard rumors that Indrabadi was not willing to marry but I wanted to see these rumors myself that is why I came to this kingdom and when I realized that both of you are truly in love and are willing to get married to each other I understood that what is going on is much more important than my selfish needs it is my responsibility to convince your father and let you both get married as Indravati was inside the room for a very long door once the door opened Pramila got to see the man that saved her from the elephant a while ago and she was absolutely filled with joy to see him Pramila looks at Anandin and says this I'm so glad to see both of you together. Now you can finally be in peace Arnan. Then realizes that this is the girl that he saved from the elephant a while ago. Anand then looks at her and says this. Since both of them are together now come. On now it is our turn to be together as 
Well what do you say Ram Mila nods her. Head and agrees to Anandan's proposal. After that Anand then goes to the king. And explains to him everything that had. Occurred until then Anand then makes. Sure that Prasanna and Indravati is. Married later Anandan and Pramila both. Get married and they both go back to. Our Nathan's kingdom the couples live. Happily ever after. If you like this story do like it and. Share it for more new stories please. Subscribe our new stories.